I am so freaking hyped. I'm going to give you one exercise that's going to completely blow your mind. Now, before I show you the exercise, I want to preface this by saying that my point in this exercise that I'm literally about to show you is that the reason you haven't actually attracted in your dream relationship is because of your ex. Now, what do I mean by that? What does your dusty ex have to do with anything? Well, whenever we go through relationships and it's less than ideal, it's anything less than unconditional love and nurturing, we internalize stories or trauma based on how the person treated us, how the relationship actually ended, and what we made it mean about us. And these stories are living dormantly in our subconscious mind, causing us to continue to attract the same story, the same situation, basically in a different body. And how if you want to really get serious about attracting in your dream relationship, really breaking the pattern of attracting these unavailable men and actually getting the men that you really want we have got to go into the subconscious to be able to heal and shift this. Take out your pens and papers. You're going to go back just three X's, okay? I have John, Jacob, Jingleheim, and Schmidt. Don't get intimidated by the artistry that's here, okay? Then I want you to make three columns. How did he make me feel? I want you to list out how this person made you feel. Beginning, during, and even during the breakup and the not-so-good parts. How did it end? And then what stories did I internalize? What this means is what are the stories I told myself about what it means about me? So as an example, I could have broken up with John, but I made it mean that I'm not good enough. Not a good story. And then what's probably going to end up happening is when I go over to Jacob's column in Jacob breaks up with me, what I made that mean is that I'm not good enough. And what you're going to realize is that there's actually cyclic patterns that are repeating themselves in the same freaking situation, no matter how many times you rotate the, the guy. The guy is irrelevant. You're attracting men to actually just play out patterns and stories based on the trauma that you have inside of you. So let's do this together for two seconds, okay? Even just vocally. Go back three X's. How did that man make you feel? How did two X's back make you feel? How did one X back make you feel? What were the common characteristics between all three of these partners? How did these relationships end up ending? If you want to fundamentally heal yourself, glow from the inside out and change what you're attracting so that you can actually attract men that are high caliber men that want you, adore you, choose you, are obsessed with you, golden retriever energy, whatever it is you're after, that they treat you like absolute gold. They go above, beyond and more for you. You can follow any of these cheap tricks online, <laughs> but they're not going to work until you actually deal with the subconscious first. You can see all this golden retriever, black cat energy, masculine, feminine, whatever it may be, but until you actually deal with the subconscious, none of it's going to work. Comment down below with what you figured out from this exercise. And if this sounds interesting to you and you'd like to learn more, I have a free strategy call in the link in my bio for my program Chosen. It's a three-month high-level freaking program. Oh, of course, someone just literally got in as I'm talking about it. I love it. I'm so excited. Um, this is all about co-mingling with high level women that are successful, accomplished, ambitious, but they're not attracting the men of their dreams. The women in these programs, they're doctors, they're lawyers, they're teachers, they're software engineers, they're like software founders, they're business owners. They're in some instances also like single moms. But what they all have in common is that they're not actually attracting men to want them, choose them, be obsessed with them, go all in with them, commit to them long term, pursue them, chase them. Like they're not actually attracting the type, the qualities or the characteristics of that idealistic dream relationship. No matter how much action steps they're taking, they're just not able to get there. That's when you know you have a subconscious blockage or blockages. 
This program's all about healing from the inside out, becoming the highest, best version of yourself, balancing your masculine, feminine energy so that you can attract men who want you, who adore you, who choose you, who go all in with you, who want to put a ring on your finger and literally take you out of the dating game. When you shift the subconscious and embody this new energy, men are gonna chase you, men are gonna pursue you, men are gonna want you, men are gonna go all in with you. To enroll directly is the link in my bio. And how good was this exercise? Let me know, I wanna hear your results down below. When I noticed these patterns and when I was given a process on how to shift them, my whole romantic life changed. And so did these women. I want to bring this process into the hands of more and more and more women so that we can all finally attract that dream relationship and be loved and committed to the way that we really deserve. It all starts with the inside first.